Hello everyone, we are from Section 2 Management of Technology. Today we are going to learn about technology absorption. Technology absorption is acquisition, development, assimilation and utilization of technological knowledge and capability of a firm. It occurs when transferring and receiving entities. Two capabilities when information is able to be understood and utilized by the firm. The technology will then be further optimized and upgraded. Next is the research and development. R&D aims to create new technology or information that can improve the effectiveness of product or make the production of the product more efficient. So now we are going to learn about the influencing factors of technology absorption. There are five influencing factors which is the growth and the quality concern, communication, knowledge management, financial discipline, and also good management. The first one is the growth and quality concern. Growth and quality accomplishment require cross-functional teamwork and the level of integration of R&D activity can be a decisive factor in absorption. There are two elements in communication. The first one is the nurture technological gatekeeper, which the group role consists of channeling data regarding technological innovation into the establishment from the outside. Next is the nurture boundaries planners, which they understand, translate, disseminate knowledge between the firm and the technology. There are two types of knowledge management, which is tacit and explicit. Tacit knowledge is when information is often used but cannot be externalized and cannot be easily diffused. While explicit knowledge is when knowledge that is easily transmitted to other companies. Financial discipline is when ideas obtained from different sources about that technology meet internal needs and capabilities. The opportunities for competitive edge become more clearer. Good management is when the technology is accepted by the organization. This happens when there's a team that trains the worker into a new facility. Basic components of technology absorption. Hardware is particular physical structure and layout which are part of the session process. Software is refers to know-how of carrying out tasks to achieve goals and objectives. Brainware is application and justification of hardware, software, development, know what and know why of technology. Support net is complex network of physical, informational and socio-economic transformation. Few methods used to manage technology absorption. Hiring of requisite skilled workforce, installation of effective communication system, developing time bound and target oriented schedule, top management support, use of multifunctional teams by technology. But not least, there are few benefits of technology. Repeated collaboration for the same product are avoided. The base for technological self reliance is enhanced. The ability is developed to unpackage technology. Acquisition of other technologies becomes selective.